There we go. We need that. Yeah, Chris. Corbin is the best, man. I think it's my favorite planet. It's so fun. It's the most immersive of all the planets for me. The first time I played through this, I was like, okay, this is like the best game I've, I've ever played, ever. It's just so good. It's so immersive. Uh, launch the special cold grenade at it. Yeah, I feel it. It kind of look, looks, looks like in any other cave or like uh, other sections of the game too, and the tombs. Some of the reused assets can be confusing. I, I see what you see what you mean. We solved the ice puzzle. Ow! That actually really hurt, it. Charlie. What's in here? Okay. Oh! Look at it. It's so crispy. Open. Yes. Yes. Amazing. Sith statue. That's where the lightsaber is. Star map. Look, it's reacting differently because it was the last one. It's doing something. What is that? Ooh, I just got goosebumps. I'm goosebumping. Ooh. I'm bumping. Get it. Look at it! Feast your eyes. So good. That would be a sick tattoo, honestly. No! I've been looking forward to that moment for months. Okay. Sith lightsaber. It's got a different name, but it's the same stats. But it's called Sith lightsaber. Light Sith lightsaber. Months, I tell you. Months! But, yeah... The exact same lightsaber, but it has a different name, and it has a red crystal in it, so there's that. It's style pun points. It's cooler than the average lightsaber, I suppose, but it's no different, really. Oh, frick, these guys. Okay. So, you return to us with the lightsaber in hand, Not as really. I knew you would. The Force has served you well. You took a great risk in acquiring the artifact. You used your mind and your power. No peaceful meditation, no pacifism. Sometimes you must fight in order to achieve. This gives you your passion. This makes you stronger. This is what makes you superior. That is the lesson we teach with that part of the final test. Do you understand? The Sith are not the only ones. Are you seeing a Jedi couldn't have gotten the lightsaber? When a Jedi acts, it is with skill, true. But the Jedi teach you that your passions are counterproductive, that strength is only found in peace. Did you not feel a moment of excitement in the tomb? Yeah. Did your passions not flow and make you feel stronger and more alive? Maybe. What purpose would be served by restricting yourself from such? I would say only the purpose of the Jedi. Through this, they would control you and restrict your potential. The Sith are not the only ones who fight and take risks. True, but most would say they fight only when they must, or not at all. We are the ones who know that struggle is what makes us superior. I wouldn't say I exerted myself getting this. Perhaps not to someone of your natural strength. The point is in the recognition of the nature of the act, rather than its sheer difficulty. Now he's backtracking. He was like, you will face your death in there. And now he's like, yeah, I, I mean, it, it was, it, it's, it's about what you did, not how hard it was. <laughs> uh huh. Yeah. Okay, Uthor. I don't believe you. I don't feel superior to anyone. If you came anyway. to the academy, you must have felt the stirrings within you that cry out for the freedom of the dark side, that cry out for release. 
I can only show you the path that will lead to power and superiority. You have followed it this far. You must decide if you are capable of continuing. And if I'm not? This is where your path ends, young one. There is no turning back once you have embarked on it. I think I understand. Good. The last part of your test will now commence. Here, you will learn the lesson of competition. All life must compete in order to flourish. Such is the natural way of the universe. To stand still is to know death. One must always be moving forward. So it is the same amongst the Sith. Compete or die, mercy is irrelevant. So it behooves you in this final test Boom. to strike down one you are familiar with for no other reason than to prove you are superior and without mercy. Normally, this would be against another student. You, however, get a special treat. You will fight Euthora here, my own apprentice. What? So this is what you had planned all along? You wish me killed? Indeed. You have become too ambitious, Euthora. It is time for you to die and someone more talented to take your place. This guy. No. It is time for you to die, Master. My pupil stands with me. Oh, is this true, young one? You wish to join Euthora in her foolish scheme? Hmm. I choose me. Hmm. I'm sorry, Uthar. I'm with Euthora on this one. Do you hear that, my master? That is the sound of a new leader rising to replace you. So the time has come, has it? You both wish to stand against a Sith master and perish, do you? Then so be it. And so be it. Can I force kill him? Oh, psh. Push over. Ah! Oh! is finished. <laughs> and a new order is brought to the academy. Yeah! Excellent. While I do like you, truly, I'm afraid I'm not the type to share power with anyone, even you. But I don't want any power. If only I could believe you. Let's get this over with, quickly. Yeah, of course you're back at this moment, huh, Phenomenal? Get choked. <laughs> Get choked. Oh, stop. I healed. You are too strong for me. Yeah. I was a fool to think otherwise. I am at your mercy. Pretty much. <laughs> Force kill is just OP, man. It's a stun and a dot. And I think a debuff. Like it lowers their defenses too. It's like the it's it's the best power in the game. Force kill, easily, hands down. It's got the perfect trifecta there. You ask for mercy? You? A Sith? I suppose I am. Something tells me that you are not like the other students. I don't know why that is. I was right the first time back at the cantina, wasn't I? There is something different about you. More so than I even suspected. Out of the three Jedi classes, which do I think is the best? The most balanced is, uh... Sentinel. Sentinel is gonna have, like, a good balance between, like, force powers and, like, melee capabilities. Like, melee damage capabilities. Um, but honestly, you can play, do pretty balanced builds between any of the three. So it's really just up to you. You can make them all balanced and, you know, do different builds certain ways. But obviously if you go like the, uh, it's gonna, it's gonna depend more on your not, on your non Jedi class. Like if you go soldier, scout, scoundrel or whatever at the beginning. That, that matters a little more, I think. But Sentinel is going to be the, what the game considers the most balance. But 
you can go consular and still like be very capable in melee. Like if you go soldier into consular, you can have like a lot of feats and be like more of a brawler, but still have access to like more force powers and stuff. So you can make them all pretty balanced. Have more life experience than other two classes. What do you mean by life experience? I'm not here to become a Sith. I got what I came for. I didn't think you were here to train. Not really. I should have realized that sooner. So what happens now? Will you show me mercy? Will you just let me leave? Tell me why you tried to kill me first. I had no choice. You reminded me too much of a time before I became a Sith. I didn't want to think about that. Maybe you should think about it. I suppose you could be right. All the things I wanted to do, all the wrongs I wanted to right, I haven't done any of it. They just get farther and farther from my mind. All I've cared about <clears throat> is power and myself. This isn't the person I was. Hmm. Always, Dorzen. Got to. There's still time to change that. You're right. Maybe what I needed most was peace after all. The Jedi tried to show me that. I don't know if I can ever go back to them, but my place isn't here. Thank you. Thank you for showing me that. You have a destiny, my friend, and I wish you well on your way to it. May the Force be with you. She said it! The light side. Honestly, I've done a lot of light side playthroughs, but this might be like the first time I actually like redeemed her, because I don't know, like maybe I've failed like the persuasion there earlier. Or just didn't even like, didn't pick the right options or something. This might have been the first time I've done it. I, I've probably done it once in the past. But like, I almost forgot that you could do this. So that's pretty cool. That's pretty awesome. Light side points gained. Oh, I thought that was going to put me right at the cap. That would have been so satisfying. If it weren't for those dark side decisions earlier, that probably would have. Like earlier in the playthrough. I've done a couple of them. That would have been so satisfying on that moment. Bye, Euthura. Uh, I guess we're going the same way. Uh, awkward. Hey, uh, so... Do you want me to, like, heal you? I've got, like, force healing thing. It's a light side thing. Since you're all, like, light side now, like, I can heal you. No? I mean, look, check this out. It swirls. Welcome to the light side. I got a couple med packs. You want a couple med packs? You're struggling. I feel kind of bad. No. I'll let you open the door for me. I appreciate it. She's fine. Do 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 Because you can do a thing doesn't mean you must do a thing. Hmm. I disagree entirely. If only my mind could uh Exactly. Opinions on... But she to me uh, in considered uh, Sentinel because even though her master is Anakin, she learned a lot from Obi-Wan. Oh, Ahsoka? That's what you mean by life experience. I get what you're saying. Yeah, I don't, I don't actually know much about the lore between the different... Like, I know what a Guardian Sentinel Consular are, but I don't know much about the lore of where they each come from, so I couldn't couldn't say on a, on a lore level. But Ahsoka, I mean, yeah, Ahsoka's probably be a Sentinel, Sentinel or Guardian. She's pretty crafty though, and Sentinels have more uh, are generally have more like skills, like computer use, security. 
non-force uh, abilities. Hey, Captain Cook. Uh, so we did everything here. I'll give you three seconds to get your ass out of here. Uh, that's right. One, that's right. So we need to go two. back to uh, this is my Tatooine. own private domicile, and I will not be harassed, bitch. Whoa. Welcome to the domicile. Oh. Hello? You there. How is it that you're leaving Nagasado's tomb by yourself? You went in for your final test, didn't you? Where is Master Uthar? Didn't you see Uthura? She just hobbled on through here. Master Uthar is dead. I killed him. What? You? But you aren't even a Sith yet. Surely you jest. It's it's Whoops. a spy. Quick, to arms. I accidentally. Don't. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to press that. I pressed it by accident. I'm gonna reload that because I don't even know what I said. What? He's you a dead. spy. Master Uthar is dead. I killed him. What? Hmm. Did I say dead? Uh, he's, uh, sick. You should check on him. You lie. Look, I don't need any trouble here, all right? Well, you found it. If you've done anything to Master Uthar, you're going to pay for it. But what if Master Uthar is really dead? How can we hope to stand up against someone who could kill him? Don't be a sniveling coward. I will prove this one a spy. And if Uthar is dead... I shall become the new master. Mm hmm. Right. Ow. <coughs> These guys might be harder than the previous fight. <laughs> wow. These guys uh, are terrible. They haven't hit me once. Feels good. Hmm. You guys are doing great. Keep it up. See, this is why you invest in some dexterity as a consular. It just makes yeah. it really hard to hit. <clears throat> and these robes that I'm using are, like, just disgusting. The Keldroma robes are so good. And then we nuke. Why didn't that only hit one? Weird. There we go. Get out of my way, citizens. Do you have loot, though? No remains, huh? Useless. Useless! Yeah, they're so good, Doors, and it's so satisfying to have them now. And that crystal, we're going straight to a workbench. Oh, oh! Oh, frick, I have to fight the whole academy.